Wow. Well, here we are back with more 125 racing. This time the uh, younger 12 to 14 years uh, class, and uh, this time brought to us by Robertson Motor Group. Robertson Motor Group. Well, what is it, of course? It's a uh, fine extended family, as well as uh, being Robertson Prestige uh, on the corner of uh, JFK and Angatige. Uh, it's also the likes of uh, Robinson Motor Group, the home of Isuzu uh, Trucks and their fantastic uh, uh, truck support uh, network. That's a big operation up there on the railway road in Palmerston North, so uh, check it out. But of course for Robinson Prestige, it's Audi, it's Volkswagen, it's uh, Skoda as well. Skoda is chosen now by the New Zealand police for their vehicles. Had a friend of mine who bought a Skoda and said, man, man it, it, if it wasn't for the fact that you went on the name, you'd see with their reputation or their previous, you wouldn't have bought it. But then to actually do the, uh, not just the sums, but to do the engineering excellence, he said what a standout motoring machine it was. And uh, he made the change to a, uh, a new Skoda. So uh, I don't just think of their name as something from uh, years gone by. Think of it from uh, something as a uh, new force in world leading motoring. So uh, check it out from uh, Robertson Prestige right here in uh, Palmy North. Here we go, the Jack Show, the Jack Show, Mr. Jack Ellingham, great work for Jack out there. Here we go, 99. Oh, much better, much better, 10 or 26, whichever way you're looking at Levi Townley. And Levi putting on a hot rocking show at this stage, so but Levi's got the better of as well, so uh, go for the run, Levi, that second place, and we talked about it, that smaller bike, that is the uh, 85 for the big kid, so uh, think to be around 105 cc's. So to be in uh, second place, that's better, and there he goes. So you're getting that uh, mic to work for him, getting that speed on the corner, getting that to literally uh, drift around the corner, and keeping a power on at the same time. We're going to watch, and again, an example of how low you can go, another Hannah Paris kind of uh, performance on her corner, and great to watch. 282 spotting in there again with our uh, require visitor up there, Ben Costello. So to watch the traffic. Right, uh, 66 and rocking for it, go Jack, Jack all the way, uh, Jack Ellingham putting on another share, yes indeed, uh, 50 years of domination from 1973 to 2023, and now we moved on, so it's 51 years of domination, the world's greatest uh, brand back there, Honda, the pair of dreams, and long time sponsors of Woodville Motocross, bring it on with Honda, 88 to go, the Jack Ellingham show, first place, second now for uh, Levi. Only a matter of uh, weeks before he's out on his uh, actual 125. So although riding in the 125 class for the last uh, 12 months or so, now to actually an opportunity to be on a 125, we'll look out for with interest and uh, bring it on. The Levi Townley Show coming to you on a 125 very shortly. All right, 99, 282, 99 to get up there. Uh, Jack Thompson out of Waipukarau on that Bay Motorcycle and Mills Honda Off-Road Cycle Works uh, Tube Works. Stevenson and Taylor sponsored KDM 125. Go Jack. Well, Robinson Motor Group, uh, 12 to about uh, 14 years class, and uh, somebody just down here at the moment, and that's what, you, what you're actually watching, and the, the, the real hiccup of what goes on there 
is the fact that in that whole time that the rider was resting there, a yellow flag was out for all the other riders, so it slows up the pace of the race. So uh, it's where we're more consciously than ever before, you've got to get people up and going again. Well, the uh, turquoise and uh, black numbers signify our women's class. So we've got some of the girls that are out there and riding in this. So, again, an opportunity we talked about before that girls can often double class, be in their respective age group and be in their women's class as well. All right, there we go, 66, the high-flying Jack Ellingham on the Yamaha New Zealand, Mr. Motorcycles, uh, a Troy Lee design bike. One, two, three, four, looking to uh, Mighty, Mighty Mares. Here he goes, the Teru hero today. Mr. Mares parks in there on uh, 199. This time, and uh, Travis Taylor on that uh, CSL Honda Hub uh, Taylor Farm supported KDM 125. So uh, go, Travis. Travis Taylor, of course, uh, reason for the support of Honda Hub, of course, he stepped up to the uh, 250 CRF as well. So he's seen the light and got up to a uh, big time uh, Honda race bike. And that means that uh, Honda no longer have a 125 two stroke. So you won't find uh, Hondas in the field unless they're a resurrected older model bike. It's a bold decision environmentally that Honda made many years ago. After all, they've been the forerunner of environmental changes uh, in the motorcycle world. And uh, that's uh, some of the standard that we lead with today, that the rest of the world has uh, followed, because uh, Honda first is uh, Honda forever. All right, uh, Robinson Motor Group, 12 to 14 years class, and uh, still looking out, 66 for uh, Jack out there. On the MR New Zealand, Mr. Motorcycles, Troy Lee Watson Racing, uh, uh, Dr. Uh, Trim, uh, Power Parts Depot supported uh, YZ125, so uh, Jack's a man. There he goes. So uh, 66 ahead of uh, 10 slash 26. Here we go now with that uh, Mares looking out. Here's uh, Travis in behind him. Well, certainly got an idea that these would be our uh, top four riders. And uh, in the first race, of course, it was uh, uh, the first three one two fives ahead of uh, Levi. But the start that he got here today and the back that he made on the field and what he's opened up now, we're keen actually to look at retrospect as what his times were in moto number one compared to what he's now doing in moto number two because he has pulled out the stops big time. And uh, Mares and Travis have no answer for him on that small bike at the moment. So pretty incredible ride out there. 26 on the Sherpa, 10 on the bike for Levi Townley on the uh, Yamaha YZ112, it's officially called. So the, uh, some of the brands have a 105, others have a 108. The Yamaha's gone 112. So what it means is that uh, you've effectively got a, a two-stroke motorcycle of 85 origin with a, a, a big bore kit to give it that little bit more power to make it more uh, competitive, more challenging, more aligned with the uh, 125 CC bike. You still might be down you know, 20 plus uh, cc, but you know, it's a lighter bike, it's easy to handle, got a lower center of uh, gravity. Now that the ruts are being uh, fine tuned out there, you know, it's better to handle in those conditions. So, uh, although it's a disadvantage power wise, actually, uh, as the conditions will get rougher and tougher today, as the day progresses, it'll actually be a great bike to ride out there. So, uh, check it out with Levi Townley on the hard working machine. Of course, with a three year absence of uh, Woodville really has meant that uh, it's been a long time between drinks. A lot of these guys have definitely changed classes. You know, a lot of them have never even raced a Woodward before. If they had, you know, it's like somebody like Araba Defetu, about three years ago, he was out with an injury. So it's been four years since he last raced here, 2000. And he was then on a little 65. Here he is now on a much bigger bike. So uh, just one of the stories to tell of the uh, comeback ride. 104 down here for Mason Hancock uh, Gray. The uh, Openeki uh, twins on that uh, action moto, uh, CQ uh, Farming, uh, PG O'Rourke uh, contracting, uh, Fern Fuel sponsored uh, YZ125. Fern Fuel, uh, Fern Energy, proud to be behind our event as well. It is behind the uh, Hancock Grey boys. <laughs> Well, Travis out there still in fourth place, uh, waiting for fifth, waiting for fifth. And I'll tell you what, it uh, seems like an eternity because those top four is just smashing it uh, big time. And uh, who's going to be the best of the rest? Still be a very good rider. I understand uh, Ethan Calton, a non show here at the moment, has an injury. So, uh, injured himself, generally. There we are, little Bo, little Bo. Bo up there as well, Mr. Bo Phillips, 99, and Jack Thompson. But uh, Bo, another of our campaigners 
on a, uh, a small capacity uh, bike. So another good example of it. So uh, check them out there at the moment, number 272. And that's the Husqvarna TC105. So again, 105cc uh, bike that we've uh, got out there. I want to tell you what, we're on the move, we're on the move. He's uh, a hot on attack here at the moment, so uh, check it out with uh, a Levi. Could be coming up towards our uh, white flag, but more importantly, on for Levi. He just really has started to get to get it together around here at the moment. And uh, you know, the, the old cliche when the tough gets going, they're going to get tough. Well, uh, that's exactly what he's doing out here at the moment. And uh, from that fourth place, he'll be disappointed that he knows he's capable of better results. And he's uh, put together an absolutely magnificent last couple of laps to keep on the gas here at the moment. And keep those other two very fast riders, uh, Terror Born Hero, Maz Parks in third place, and uh, Taranaki visitor Travis Taylor in the fourth spot. A big one, two, three, four here. Super excited uh, checking out your program, folks, for the uh, uh, Manawa 2 Toyota uh, New Zealand MX Up uh, 1 Grand Prix here tomorrow. Wow. This is going to be rad, I tell you what, uh, a who's who of New Zealand motocross and looking good, looking good out there. Already sort of got a, uh, a top three uh, uh, etched in in my mind, but uh, we'll wait and see just how it comes through. Uh, 727, another one to pick up on as we look back to that is uh, Max Lansbury today, the Tihora man on the uh, Davy Rocket Speed Shop. Uh, MXR uh, Rhino Power, Sergeant Motorcycles of Water Boys, Z125. Here's your race lead, there's race to lead, 88, 88. And here we are, 88, you go past it, there's 10 at the moment. So sorry, get it right, Neil, 66, 66, looking out. At least I had the same digit twice, just didn't. A, a, a graphic done of a six looks really close to an eight, of course. So uh, looking out, 66, and here we go, white flag for these boys. And uh, it's on at the moment, so. Uh, Looking out, 66 for Jack Allingham, and he's your race leader. There he goes, 66 on top of his game. Here we are with Levi down in the core, Billy bit of luck riding. Went shallow that time on the corner, literally the exit of it was a little bit out wider. So got it uh, nicely cross rutted out there. Now to come down, here's that mighty Mares. There he goes, the 259, followed by Trev here on 199. So it was the uh, 259 to look to uh, here in Maz Parks out of Manga Kino, formerly here out of uh, Pai Tour on that Watson Racing uh, Crown Kiwi, Ahapini Farming, Triple Eight uh, Training Nutrition Systems, NZ, Unforeseen Carl, Mason Builders supported uh, a TC125, uh, Go Mighty Maz. So uh, Maz Parks looking to be the uh, front runner out there. Let's see what he can do from here. We're about to find out. So. Uh, can those boys come back? There's uh, Michaela to get through there at the moment. Keep a look out for Michaela. She had a bang, bar-busting uh, performance out there in the women's class before. Had lead, dropped back to second, and then went back to about fifth or sixth place until finding a way back to get to second again. So uh, uh, great lineup for her. She'd been putting in a lot of impressive moto recently, and one of our uh, true uh, uh, ladies of the future. There we are, 28, just spotting 28 through there for Ruby, Ruby, Ruby all the way. What about 505 for Alex Bennett, the rider he man? On the Paragon Motorcycles, uh, Makatugu uh, Farm Partnership, PGG Rights and Supported, Motor SR Suspension, the Rider Circle, sponsored up YZ125. Jagged flag, 66 to do it. Well done, run it and won it. Great ride. 10 back there with uh, Levi. He will get the second place. So Jack Ellingham, number one, Levi Townley for the second. Uh, as we look out here for our one third place, yes, the mighty Maz. He will uh, take that one and take it all away. Arama Tefetu on the other bike. Now, I need to find out, that's the other 66. That was a confusing feature. So, uh, problem with his own bike. So, he's on the other number 66. So, we had two identical looking bikes out there. I, I got caught out by it once, but uh, uh, then we realised what had gone on. So, uh, just need to watch that one. Arama normally on the 105, but he was out there on 66 that time. 
So we had uh, Travis, I'm pretty sure, come in there in that fourth spot. Who's going to be fifth? Will it still be Bo? Look for the little pocket rocket. The 272 for Bo Phillips. Keep your eyes on Bo. He's been in impressive form today. Maybe was it the 104? Was that Mason that got that position? Maybe we've uh, missed him or I don't know whether I've got him. I might have, no, my apologies. He might have already gone past. But anyway, here's the others in the lineup. There's the big, no, he was there. He was there. There he goes. 272, just in front of 282. And uh, Ben Costello chased along by uh, a 303. Off with a bang that time. Hamish White out of Ashurst along with uh, 99. Jack Thompson out of Waipukarau on the KDM SX 125. So there you got the uh, Robinson Motor Group at home with the uh, 12 to 14 years 125 class.